Welcome to this video on the basics of Ranarex Spy. Ranarex Spy provides all of the functionality needed to explore and analyze desktop and mobile applications or websites under test, including their controls and UI elements. To begin, launch the application under test and start Ranarex Spy. The element browser in Ranarex Spy contains all currently running applications from your Windows desktop and mobile devices. The fastest way to find a specific UI element in the object tree is to track it. Ranarex Spy supports two ways of tracking UI elements, using the track button and instant tracking. To start tracking a UI element, click the track button. Move your mouse pointer over a specific control, such as a button or a text box, to highlight the currently identified object. Click the control to stop the tracking mode and to display all of the information on the selected UI element. If you want to track menu or pop-up items, use the instant tracking method. Simply move your mouse pointer over a menu item and press the Control plus Windows logo key combination to instantly track the UI element. Instant tracking is not only available for pop-up items, it can be used for any UI element. You can also navigate manually through the Ranarex Spy's element tree or use the image navigator. At the top of the image navigator, you can see the adapter type and the name of the currently selected UI element. Move the mouse over a specific child element to see the adapter type and its name. Clicking a UI element selects it, while double-clicking outside the selected element selects the parent. You can use the Image Navigator even on mobile apps and navigate remotely on mobile devices. You can add the found element to the object repository. Or, if you want to use the element in a recording module, simply drag and drop it from Ranarex Spy to the Action Editor. A corresponding repository element is created automatically. If you want to use the element directly in code, Drag and drop the element to the line in the code where you want to perform your action. To verify the element, run the recording module as well as the code module. As you can see, everything works as expected. In addition to these basic functions, a code module offers advanced options beyond the action set provided by the Actions Editor. For example, you can use a code module to iterate through all the available buttons and move the mouse over them. To learn more about these advanced options, have a look at the code examples in the Ranarex User Guide, available online at the Ranarex website. Thank you for watching this video on Ranarex Spy Basics.